welcome back to my channel. I'm Jayanshi, and after so long, this intro is here finally. I am very happy, like really, really happy. And I don't know what explanations to give because no matter how many explanations I give, it's just never valid. I was totally dead from YouTube, even though I've uploaded after months and months because I didn't want my channel to die completely. I didn't want you to think that I was dead. So I hope you are aware that I was alive. Surprise! <laughs> okay, so I know it might be a bit confusing after reading today's title, like the video's title. It must be confusing because you guys must be thinking that, bro, what the hell are you saying? Isn't YouTube a social media platform? Of course it is. And I cannot leave YouTube because I really like it. But I'm talking about the platforms like Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and all, even though I was never on Facebook, but I'm just talking about Instagram specifically because I was connected to it at a really big, big level. Instagram was like my everything as I used to wake up, I used to open Instagram, then my whole day I would just vlog myself on Insta and I would show to I would show to everyone that see bro, I'm so cool. And yeah, that's uh, the true thing is people used to think I'm cool, but after sometimes I realized myself that I'm not a cool, I'm just a fool. So today I thought of giving you a brief story on how this happened and why it happened and did it do anything good or it didn't do any changes at all. I want to be completely real with you, so I would not speak any lie, I pledge. So for the very first thing, before knowing about anything, why did I do it? What was the reason of leaving social media and suddenly deleting Instagram and never going back? Like, believe me, I deleted Insta, I guess, four to five months ago, I don't remember at all. But when I deleted it, I never thought of downloading it. It was just not completely my own decision. My friends also made me realize that, yes, it is not good for me. Why, first of all, why I started liking it so much. See, what happened due to this COVID situation, we were locked inside our homes. So I didn't have access to my friends who were in school. So I was just completely isolated in the room. I always stay in my room still. I don't know why I just never go out of it because I don't really need a big space. I live in a very small space. Small space, I don't mean like the space in my room. I mean that I don't have a big circle now. My circle is very small, like so small that you can't even know what it is. <laughs> Anyways, okay. So I was talking about, so what happened is after my schools opened, I actually stopped being on Instagram that much. I just used to post stories and I just, I just stopped using it very often. I was posting, I wouldn't lie, I was posting and I was talking to my friends also, like my social media friends, but I lost interest. This was the main thing. Okay, so first, why I did it? Because this is the most important question. Okay, how you did it, when you did it, that's all is a secondary factor. But why? Why, Vivianchi? Why? 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 What was the reason? I think that at a point, I realized that social media is consuming a lot of things rather than giving me something. See, the thing is, we all humans, we like something when it is easier to do and it doesn't take much effort. And if you don't believe me, then I don't know how to make you believe. So I have two options for you, okay? This is just to check what is your mentality. First one is, you are doing hard work and you are getting the payment. And second is you're sleeping, you're watching Netflix, you're watching you YouTube and Instagram, and even doing while doing that, you are getting paid. What would you choose? I, okay, okay, if you are lying to yourself, then I know that you will say that I will do hard work. And if, if some people are not lying to themselves and actually choosing hard work, then bro, hats off, hats off to you. But okay, coming to reality, you would choose to stay in your room, watch Netflix, enjoy and get money free money so that's how it works we humans are especially me because i don't want to sound like a philosopher okay so me i like doing things which don't need a lot of efforts i used to like i have improved a lot now okay okay just shut up so this was the main thing i thought that social media is consuming a lot 
second is that i got real people in my life real people means not that human being of course on social media also i used to talk to humans only <laughs> but the thing is when i started interacting with my friends who are from my school then i thought that these people are much better like they know who i am because i'm not on a filter here if you have friends which you have made on social media and they're trustworthy then that's too great but in my case it didn't happen and i think that it was a part where i should have thought a lot like whom you're trusting whom you are telling your daily things it's very important i mean i can film a separate video on how you should understand that who are the ones who are actually care caring for you and who are the ones who are just there for you know just their own comfort anyways we are not talking about that the third reason why i quit why i quit social media is that it was you know burdening on my academics and most importantly i was not able to post on youtube you know the time where i started being on instagram so much i forgot that youtube was the one who gave me this much push that where i was that time i was there because of youtube only on instagram i had i had 3000 followers 2000 to 3000 and that was all because of my youtube channel but i just thought that youtube is youtube who cares and due to that moment till now i'm not able to get hang of youtube we go see what happened when i stopped uploading due to no reasons i felt as if okay i'll get back i'll get back i'll get back and when i actually wanted to come back and post on youtube i didn't have the opportunity because i had exams like of course exams uh, in this like grade 9th even right now i had exams but i literally swore to god that no matter no matter how much effort it take i will start posting on youtube i don't care who watches and who doesn't i just want to post because this was something that i like doing and i still really really like it so these are all the things that made me think that okay i don't need it i don't need instagram for my livelihood okay i just don't need it so why it is important to quit it like why i did it it is okay but why is it important so the first thing is what happened is you stop appreciating your life and it takes so much you wouldn't realize i know you would think that what happens i just spend 2 hours of my day on scrolling insta and talking to my friends is it actually affect, affecting something but believe me it is no matter how long or how less you be on social media in my advice if you will take my advice i would say that spend as much as less you can stop interacting with people and stop showing everything see if you are a person who can manage their daily lives while using social media then you are top level you are on you know you are doing everything nicely i also used to do that at a moment but maybe i was not that strong mentally strong to continue both my normal life and social media because see believe me or not social media and your normal life are two different things So if you want to live one life then just stop using social media or just stop be being real in your life and i think that the second option is way more tough now uh, i have specified a lot of problems that social media created but on a very this highlight point i want to say that my sleep cycle you will think that bro what are you saying i think after you after you uh, stop uh... okay anyways So my sleep cycle was affected because of you know being on Instagram always because I used to scroll at 3 a.m. blah 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 oh my god this that this but after stop after stopping it means you know after just deleting the whole application from all my devices my sleep cycle improved at such a good level you will not believe me literally I used to sleep at 3 4 a.m. now I sleep at 12 1 means this is the time highest otherwise sometimes 11 11 30 so this is my biggest accomplishment that i have made see the thing is you can leave something but when you realize that okay because of this i have gained this then you start feeling that okay it was for good and i wouldn't give full credits to me even my friends told me that no it's not good for your health and that's why people are very important in your life 
and you should hear the one who cares for you. Wow, I feel like a philosopher right now. Jokes apart, do what you want and do whatever that makes you happy. But don't do the things which are affecting your own life or maybe the life of others. And also, if you think that I'm speaking bullshit, then just go away go away even though even though i still use my phone but for purposes which are good only and i don't know why my accent changed so horribly but okay it did anyways even though my parents still say that i'm always always on my phone even if my screen time is one hour two hours in the entire day and that also uh sometimes i'm making my notes from google so yeah that's a good thing i'm just appreciating myself right now. Now most importantly do I miss social media the simple answer is no do I want to go back no am i happy with this decision yes am i telling you to do the same no then why am i filming this video just to give you awareness just to spread awareness so that's it for today i hope you liked it and i hope you learned a lesson from my life make sure you like subscribe and share Wow good and i'll see you in the next one bye